Yeah, and the flooding hit especially hard in Highland Falls, Orange County, New York. This is just to the south of West Point. Roads turning into rivers and homes flooded. So Mark Zahakos, he is a Highland Fall resident. He was out shopping when the floods actually came in and he captured it all on video. He joins us now, Mark. So glad you are safe. That's got to be a precarious spot to be in. You're trying to, you know, get out and about, do some errands. And then this flooding came through. Can you walk us through how fast this water rushed in? Yeah, definitely. Thanks for having me. Um, so it took, you know, no time at all, really, to, to really get too crazy. Um, we were driving through the road, hit some, some flash flooding on the on the highway, uh, was able to kind of turn around, backtrack, take the back roads home. By the time we hit town, though, it was just devastated, like so bad everywhere, flooding everywhere, houses, like it was, it was crazy. And Mark, you're really giving us, I mean, that front row seat into what exactly played out all throughout the afternoon into the evening hours last night. Um, the area here in Highlands Falls, a beautiful part of New York, off the Hudson River, you could see water rushing through the, the streams and also onto the road. I mean, have you ever, I don't know if you're a native, but have you ever seen anything like this mm. happen? No, definitely not. I mean, we, you know, we're, we're relatively new to town. We moved here in the summer of 2020, and this hasn't happened, you know. I mean, when it rains, the, the creek that kind of runs through town, that's, that's a Highland Brook, it's called, um, it empties out into the Hudson, but it runs through the entire town, and I've never seen it like this. The, when it rains, it'll the, the water levels will rise a little bit, but nothing like this. Um, but all my neighbors who have lived here their entire lives, like, They've never seen it like this. You know, our town has, has never had this happen. That, that really speaks a lot because a lot of people were talking about, you know, this could be something similar to Hurricane Irene, of course, in 2011. But when you hear from locals saying, actually, we've never seen anything like this. And I think it's important when you're looking at this visual you have here, Mark, of all of these is the water is getting over the roads easily. It's at every twist and turn for your residents. What kind of damage and flooding did you see? I mean, the roads themselves, you know, de definitely got uh, destroyed. Uh, homes were kind of the basements were, were flooded. Homes were kind of destroyed. Uh, it was it was nuts. All of downtown, all of our main street down in Highland Falls. Um, it, it, today, it looks like a beach a little bit. You know, there's a bunch of sand and sediment kind of washed al along Main Street, Highland Falls, which is crazy to see. Yeah, I, I mean, it's just so unbelievable to see that flowing through the street. And I think, it, honestly, I kind of did a double take to see how close it gets to people's homes. Um, out and about today, have you been able to see um, the conditions? Have you seen any improvements, maybe some of that water receding throughout the day today? Yeah, I mean, the water kind of receded last night, to be honest. Uh, we, you know, we lost power intermittently. Um, it came back on before it got dark. I mean, the people, ORU, kind of, and they all jumped in and, and really took care of us um, last night. We were kind of on the on the mend, I think, as of last night. Uh, today, though, we took a walk around town, check, check things out, and, you know, the water levels have gone down. The brook is still pretty powerful right now, but... Um, you're not seeing the flooding in the streets really um, anymore. That's kind of all gone away, but it's all the aftermath now, all the damage and the destruction and, and the cleanup now. Yeah, when you look at some of that damage, as you had mentioned, the roads really took a beating. Some of those roads, it looked like it caved in, and so they're going to have to test the infrastructure there. It's just impressive looking at this video how fast that water is is rushing there. Mark Zahokos, uh, thank you for joining us here. You're from Highland Falls, New York. Uh, please stay safe. It's good to know that if conditions are improving there and things are starting to dry out. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.